I'm always doing the most Finish my cup and reload Let it swing right back Hey you guys, welcome back to another video. So in today's video, I am going to be demoing a nail on the Flexi Hand and I'm so excited to try this out and share it with you guys. I actually did purchase one, but then I cancelled my order because Liz had a spare that she didn't need, so she kindly sent it over to me and I sent her a few goodies in return, so that was super kind, so thank you so much. Go and check out her channel if you you guys aren't already subscribed you should definitely check it out it is Liz acrylics nails and she is absolutely bomb so as you can see I'm coming in and I'm applying a tip and I'm just using my regular NSI poly bond glue I did struggle slightly because I was applying a tip to a tip I found it a little bit weird don't usually do that um but yeah um it just took a little minute i had to hold it in place to allow the glue to set i'm guessing sometimes it does depend on the room temperature and things like that heat and warmth does make the glue set so because it's cold it just took a little bit longer that's all so once I've applied the tip, I'm coming in with the tip cutters, I've trimmed a little bit off the end and now I'm coming in with the hand files. So I'm just tidying up the side walls and also roughing up the surface of the tip just to make sure that everything's nice and the shape is exactly how I want it. So now finished filing and shaping, I'm just spraying with some alcohol sanitizer and using the dust brush which is available from Glitter Planet UK. I love these little dust brushes, they are perfect, they can be washed and sanitised and they're just great at removing excess dust. And the only thing about the silicone hands I hate is the fact that the dust is real like it sticks to them so so bad so i'm coming in and i'm using laser lights from glitter planet and i'm going to be using this glam and glitz coral color and it's called your duchess and it's absolutely stunning don't even know why i spoke like that then like what is happening I'm using the number 10 magic stick and the handle that I just showed you is an old handle. I didn't like it so this is not the handle we went with. Just in case you guys are wondering if yours looks different, I have switched over to the new one but this was before the new ones came in fully made. Okay? Just so you know. So I did remove one of the fingers there because I was like, y'all, you are going to get in the way. So that is great. The fact that you can just remove fingers individually from this stand is perfect. And now I'm coming in with the acrylic and obviously just doing a nail as I would, being careful around the cuticle area, making sure to um, move any product away from the skin. And just making these nails look beautiful so yeah I really did enjoy working with the flexi hand I, the only thing that bothers me is that the fingers are slightly bulbous at the side and it's not like a normal hand would look like if you look at the side walls of your natural nails you don't have a lot of excess skin or finger at the sides there and that's the, literally the only thing that bothers me about this hand just the way it looks like it doesn't look natural, if that makes sense. I know it's not natural because it's a silicone hand, but you know what I'm saying, guys. So as you saw, I just faded down the Your Duchess colour from Glam and Glitz and then I'm coming in with laser lights and applying that to the centre, blending it up and feathering it down as well, but still leaving a clear tip at the end. I'll then come in and cap the nail and I'll file it off camera. I just filed it off camera because it was so much easier to do that. I am going to be doing a full video and showing the full hand and everything like that. So yeah, don't forget to check it out when it arrives because I will definitely be doing that.
Also, I just want you guys to know as well that I will have links where you can purchase the Flexi Hand in the description box down below. Um, yeah, I don't have any discount codes or anything like that, unfortunately, but I tried. I tried. Okay, so now I'm coming in and top coating and then I'll go ahead and cure in the lamp and show you guys the final result as well as the removal of the nail tip and how easy it is to remove and replace with a fresh one because honestly it is super, super easy. So keep watching if you want to see what that looks like. Okay, so this is how it looks finished and how a completed nail would look on the flexi finger on one of them. You do get a full hand, you get five fingers. Um, it's not bad, it really, really isn't and for the price I think it's absolutely fantastic. So I would definitely recommend. And this is what the full finger looks like and this is how you remove the tip. Super easy, it's going to be great for some quick videos for you guys, some like really fast how to's for me to be able to keep banging out videos because constantly doing your own nails literally there's only so many times i can do that which is why sometimes i struggle for content because at the minute i am not accepting clients i am so busy with glitter planet and youtube so i have my own nails to do and that is it so i needed a model or something to be able to show you guys videos but don't worry i will still have live live models as well I'm gonna kind of like mix it up for you guys. So this is how the tip comes out. It literally just pulls back out and goes in. It's that easy. And I think that is incredible. So I hope you guys enjoyed this video. If you did, please give it a thumbs up. Don't forget to share it as well and comment down below if you think that this is a good investment. And yes, thanks for watching. And always remember that you are bomb.com, lit as fuck. And don't ever let anyone tell you any different because you've got this and I love you. Bye. Let it swing right back.